Hello everybody, I'm Mr. Shinksy, and this is my Let's Play Super Mario 64. This is the 100 coin challenge of Course 14, Tick Tock Lock. And I recommend going in when the world's frozen and on Star 6, but it doesn't really matter I suppose. But, um, you need the world frozen almost to get them red coins. It's a lot easier despite a few other things being made harder because of it. And um, get that coin, get that coin. In this... This is the one world where I feel as if every coin matters. Because if you miss a single coin, this is the one world which um, you might not be able to get the 100 coin star because you missed a coin. No, no, no! I might not be able to get the 100 coins now. <sighs> anyway, um, other than them bob -ombs, I recommend starting from the bottom and going up as it's the most easy. It's easier, considering you start at the bottom anyway. But, um, destroy them two bob -ombs, get two coins, as long as you're not unlucky like I was. And, um, just get the box of coins, which will give loads more coins, and the red coins. However, be careful not to get the red, um, I mean, the star for it, because, uh, well, then you'll have to do it all over again, and that's not really much fun. So, that, that is 27 coins already. That's the easiest bit of it. The rest of it is pure hell. Because you're going to be falling a lot. Like I am. All the time. Anyway, once you've reached that, I recommend going back down to the very bottom, as if you just carry on going up, you'll miss a few coins. So just go right down to the very bottom, and this is one instance where it's easy, where it's frozen. Um, you can just flip up there to get them two coins. And you, when you flip up, you do move slightly backwards, so make sure you don't just backflip off the edge by accident. There's some more coins there, three or four, not many in that box, but... But, 32 coins already. It's quite easy so far. You haven't reached a part where you fall all the time yet. Well, I fall all the time there, so... I don't know. People are likely to have the same troubles as me, yet they're also just as not likely to have the same troubles as me, so... Depends what, how good you are at the game, I suppose. I'm not particularly that good, so... But let's just say that one life I've got might be reduced to zero by the end of the, this episode. Mm. So, just carry on your way up, and, um, yeah, you have a massive gap of coins here, so you can't really... You, well, all you have to do is move up. And this is an instance where it's harder when it's frozen, yet it's more, well, I think it's personally easier, Frozen. Do whatever you wish, whether it's easier on slow motion, but still moving, or Frozen, whatever. It depends what's easier for you. But, oh, never mind, still get that one up, good. That one up zooms to you, so you can't really miss it, I suppose. And this mouse, make sure you get it away from these two boxes, and make sure it stops. No, come back. Just stop. Stop. Thank you. Let it run our battery, and then get the two boxes, as they both, well, they both have coins in it, and you do not want that to happen. Okay, I am finally back up here, and I've caught the mouse at a time when he's, well, refueling already, or rewinding. Uh, no, 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 thank you. And here's another advantage of it being slowed down, this bit. It is increasingly annoying if um, it's moving. Um, well, not so much this bit, but the triangle shaped block earlier on. Uh, right there. If that's moving, then, well, it's extremely hard. But that blue coin um, block go... Well, that blue coin block saves you, almost. Because I, I don't think it's possible if you miss that blue coin block out. I just honestly do not think it's possible. Well, actually now think about how few star, well how few coins are in the mission already, yeah, it's impossible without it. But, um, without the coins, if you lose health, there's that star there, just so, um, just so you can still survive. Now, this is the bit I find basically impossible without, um, without, what's it called, Mo motion in, um, Whoa, 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 whoa. Luckily, you can just land on that every time, if you just push backwards on the joystick. Or forwards, depending on which way your, uh, your camera is. But, um, I always end up 
falling and quite often dying on that one bit because this area is frozen. And yet I still think it would be easier frozen than moving. I really do. But um, I will. Well, I will skip. Whoa, 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 whoa! Don't, don't fall, don't fall. Thank you. Uh, I will skip until I am actually on that platform, um, which I didn't reach just then. I fell instead. So I'll see you in a second then. Okay, I used a wall jump from down there to get up here, and it's actually surprisingly easier than I thought it would be. But every time you fall and take half the half your circle of damage, just um, recover yourself from the heart, which is just below it. Well, just there. I don't know whether you just so it kind of flicks by, but just there. There's a heart, and um, right at the very bottom of, as well. If you're desperate and get to get the help, but um, when you're when you've got to this point, just carry on. There's nothing else you can do other than climb. First of all, there isn't. Um, that box. I don't know what's in it, so I'm going to risk it just because I want to get the hundred coins. Uh, oh yes, it's coins. I think they did more coin boxes in this world just because they felt sorry for you having to get to the very top anyway. Um, yeah, okay. All you have to do is jump to that. I was getting worried for the moment that I'd fall again. Um, they're surprisingly easy when the, the world's frozen to get past. You just have to walk past them. Simple as. And you honestly thought I was going to fall then. Hmm. But once you reach this part, it becomes especially hard. Because although there's um, some coins there in that box, you still have to go past these. I believe if you fall, you die. Not very forgiving. Oh, that's just one up in that box down there. Um, hmm. Where am I going to get 12 coins? I'm honestly worrying now. Where's this? Where is there 12 coins? Oh, here, good, good. I'm sure there's some coins here, so... Yep. Two more coins. Please hold coins. No! Seriously, are they going to do this to me? Are they going to do this to me? They're going to do this to me, I know they are. Over there are the only stars... No, coins, sorry, left in the game. I mean, course. And... Um, no, 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 no. Thank you. And I'm pretty sure I know way to them, but I'm not certain. I'm... Oh, yeah, yeah, good. Thank you. You can just long jump over here and get the coins. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, um, I believe there are only 110 coins in the entire map. I have no idea where the other two coins are, but... That is the 100 coins of um, Tick Tock Clock. So, um, I'll just die. Uh, no, oh, there's coins in there actually, actually I think. Never mind. So, um, in the next episode I'll be starting course 15. So, I bid you all farewell. Bye.